With the Supreme Court's decision to overturn Roe versus Wade, coordinators are gearing up for an increase in kids up for adoption or foster care. One couple shared with Jose Alonso their experience of being foster parents and why they encourage other couples to take on the challenge. The Fostering Collective has been working to support foster and adoptive families. Serving about 100 families through support groups, supplies, and services to getting parents verified, this organization is ready to help anyone fostering or adopting a child. We've had in our home about 23 or 24, um, some just for maybe six days, uh, maybe a month or six weeks, six months, 12 months, 18 months, two years. I mean, we've had... Um, a wide variety. Every case is different. Uh, no two CPS cases are going to go exactly the same. Amanda's husband, Tony, also volunteers with the collective. We just have to believe that the seeds that we plant in these kids, that as they go along in their life, that, that there's going to be fruit that's going to grow from that, and we trust in that, and we've had some tremendous opportunities. So how will adoption agencies help expecting mothers who can't keep their child? We expect to see um, and hear from more young women who um, are pregnant and didn't plan to be and are wanting to know what their options are. When a young woman gets pregnant, didn't plan to be, um, sometimes the best way that she can be a mother is to choose adoption for her baby. So we want her to know as much about adoption as possible. We want her to understand um, the ins and outs of it. But that's not possible without volunteers. If you feel like it's right for you, you need to do it. If it's been on your heart for a while, it's time. And um, yes, it's scary, but um, it's also scary to think what's going to happen if you don't obey that calling. In White House, Jose Alonso, CBS 19. The Fostering Collective and Christian Homes and Family Services organizers say they are accepting help any way possible, whether it's to foster a child or to provide donations.